Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is August the 14th, 2022. I'm going to give you all a quick video about Nike. Uh, the market has been trending a lot higher than what I suspected it to do. So I wanted to come in and show you all how we should play this, right? Because at times to when the market doesn't go the way that you expected it to go, you have to be real with yourself and say, all right, cool. I need to adjust. That's, that's the only thing that we have to do is come in and adjust how the market is actually feeling from our last video. So welcome everyone to the channel. Hit the like button, so you can also subscribe to the channel. If you all wanna participate, if you all wanna join this fantastic team of subscribers, of individuals who is trying to learn how to travail and move in the stock market without any confusion. Now, I get it. From my last video in Nike, which was on the 29th of June, I get it, the market has not gone down. That is only in the short term. When you see the market in Nike on a longer term basis, let me switch this thing over to three months, right? You guys can see that this market is massively still weak. This last three monthly price bar is where the weakness really came in in Nike, right? So let's not forget that from a longer term basis, three months, even on the six months chart, that is massively weak. So I don't want us to be complacent just because we've seen the market in Nike go higher. This is how people get caught. This is how people get tricked. This is how people get caught in, in place in bad positions because they suspect that the down move is over. No, that's only momentarily. We can play both sides of the market. You know that, right? We can play both sides. Longer term, we can still be bearish. But short term, we can be bullish. There's nothing wrong with that. That's why I love the market is no one keeps us chained to how we should move. We can think and we can move how we want to make the money. So check this out. The market here in, in Nike is bullish. I, I admit to that. The market here is strong. I'm looking for the market to continue to trend higher, matter of fact. But I want to show you something, though, because on my price prediction, I have the market could possibly run up to $125.50. That is the spot. Or it might be around 130. So if I'm going to play the strength into the market in Nike, I'm going to play it that high. I'm going to look for the market to go that high. Now, the weekly chart is great. We saw the market in Nike here on this weekly price bar sell off, but we closed at the high of the bar, just like on this weekly price bar. So the bulls are definitely controlling the stock price in Nike. Look at this on the two weeks. Again, the bullishness is still here in Nike, even from a two weekly perspective. So I'm going to play strength into the market in the short term. Yeah. But my long term prediction is still the weakness is on the chart. Three months, six months, the weakness is there. So I don't want us to be blindsided as we encroach on the next six months that this market in Nike wasn't weak because it still is. OK, so I'm going to go ahead and put on this price prediction on the daily time frame. I'm going to continue to keep my long term one there, but we're going to play the strength on this one. OK, now. You guys can see that there is some areas of restriction here into the market and Nike. I don't think $117 is going to be a problem. So I'm going to look higher to where we can see the first instances of selling. And it's going to be around 120, right? So that gives us 3%. I get it. If the market only goes up 3%, hey, we'll take it. Like I said, this is only a short term bias of us looking for the price and liking to go higher. That's my first price target, 120. My second one. It's going to be up here towards 125. That's around seven, eight percent moving higher. And let's say the market was able to get a little bit more momentum and hit to 130. I'll take that too. So that's 11 percent movement higher in Nike. And that's how far I'm taking it. OK. Now. First price target was 115. No, 117. Second one is 120. I'm sorry. My first price target is 120. Second one is 125. Third one is 130. So let's just do $5 increments on the price target. Okay. Now, as long as the market in Nike continues to hold this area right here at support, we're going to continue to see the market run up. It is around 105. Okay. So this is the short term price prediction that I'm drawing on the chart in Nike. I'm looking forward to go up in the short term. But this wider area price prediction is for the long term. OK, let's go ahead and play this out. I'm done. 
give me your ideas to how you think the market and Nike is going to trade in the short term. I'm still looking for weakness in the long term, though. All right. Give me your thoughts. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.